Hello, my wonderful people, viewers, and subscribers. I don't come again. My name is Okute. I'm reporting from Okute Daily Talk channel. One of the members saying I here will tell you the whole cocoa about this Biafran struggle, Mazen Namdekano, on and off before he get problem and before uh, and uh, uh, during uh, this uh, his uh, travel and um, uh, temptation time. But there's one thing, uh, there's one uh, post I saw. I mean, that post was made uh, since uh, uh, June 30th of 2021. Uh, one um, Reverend Obina Akukwe, he made a very, very um, shocking revelation about uh, the warning he gave to Mazen Namdekano on and uh, uh, before he was uh, arrested. And according to him, he said, that report is what uh, triggered the Fulani control government of Nigeria when they placed a 100 billion naira, a 100 million naira bounty on the head of Mazen Namdekano, um, and so on and so forth. I mean, a lot of things were said, but I, I cannot, uh, I cannot be able to carry all of them uh, over my head. So that's why I said, let me bring it to the general public, so that the reason of bringing it is not uh, to mock Mazen Namdekano or to mock him either. Or to mock their friends, you understand me? Uh, because I said we, I, they said that without a, a trial, trial there will be no triumph. So, or uh, without temptation there will be no triumph. Something of that nature. English is not my language. So anyway, why I take a why I take a speaker? Nah, I'm gonna take me like that. Oh. If you come to the comment section and talk anyhow about my English, I will block one of your ear. So just avoid me. So why I'm bringing this is that uh, sometimes uh, a madman can tell you something. Just make sure that you reason with that madman. Even if not uh, instant, but at least when you go back to your bed, you close your eyes, reflect. That was a call, a reflection of things that happens during the day, either online or offline. At least it will enable us to avert or to jump some dangers on our front. So that uh, revelation, that uh, whether it's a prophecy or whatever, I don't know how he put it, but he writes it out. And I am reading from the platform of China Sangoru, and I know who he is. He's one of the DOS, the Retreat of State of Biafra. So let us read in between the lines so that uh, this one is just uh, a teacher. So, so that he can teach you something and also teach me as well that he's reading is something. Sometimes we need to obey some certain words. Sometimes, sometimes not all we need to obey, but at least we need to be taking precautions on some uh, information being given to us either by a madman either by online or offline so please like share comment and make sure you subscribe to my channel and if you see this message you didn't share it my dear <laughs> you are just joking with your destiny you need a joke with your destiny because every message you want concerning biafra you make sure you share it even if now one million share that that post get it does not come out, come out anything from your body not everything they go just they push you eh on our one no come on share video no share it takes somebody time it takes somebody time and money to be doing all these things let us go there biko i don't have time to share because it's in our one um according to say obi nakukwe i warned namdekano saved him from assassination because of that warning is what saved him as namdekano from assassination because of uh, the group who called the northern group 75 northern groups that have placed a bounty of a uh, 100 million naira on the head of Mazen Namdekano, dead or alive. But really, what they want Mazen Namdekano is to be out of this uh, surface of the earth. But not notwithstanding, um, to go Kabyama have his ways of doing things or, or the ways of handling things. But I can categorically tell you that the holding of Mazen Namdekano today is still the top notch of the Biafran movement. There's one post that came out from uh, Mazen Namdekano some couple of days ago. He said, not minding my illegal detention, let the Biafra referendum continue. In other words, he is in support of uh, what Simon Epa, Prime Minister of the Biafra Republic Government in exile, he is doing. So let us uh, support this uh, movement in any way we can. By sharing, either online or offline, just try to do what? To put your own effort or your own energy. The reward is undeniable. This message is being written by Obina Akukwe. I warned Namdekano publicly that uh, there is a plot to assassinate him before October 1st of 2021. And it is very unfortunate that he never took the warning serious, seriously. And made himself vulnerable for arrest. However, my consolation is that uh, um, 
the forces that wanted him assassinated, heeded my public warnings that it will bring bloodshed to Nigeria and instead opted for his arrest. I gave the warnings concerning plot assassinated Kano on the June 9th and the 75 northern groups placed a bounty of 100 million naira on, the, on his head. Eight days later, on June 17th, and he was arrested on June uh, 27th, 18 days after my special warning, according to um, uh, Obina Akukwe. But this Obina Akukwe, what have you been doing, at least, to help in this movement? Not minding that Martin Namdekano at last last was captured. Those who ignore my warnings or advice will surely land in net, be it Buhari, Kano, governors, Boko Haram, or whatever, according to him. Before the controversial APC bust primaries in Anambra, I begged some Igbo leaders to abandon the primaries and let us negotiate with some aggressive elements in the north to staff off an imminent evil is about to happen to Namdekano, capable of triggering a bloody conflict in Nigeria. The Igbo leaders postponed the negotiations, claimed the Kano is invincible, and they rescheduled and nego the negotiations till after the APC and PDP primaries to ensure their favored candidate wins. Alas, delay is dangerous. Today, the Biafra youth hero is arrested, and this time around, there will be no more bail for him, according to him. But this one, this is why we are, I, I disagree with you. Martin Namdekano is going to be bailed, and he will be free like a bird. It is quite unfortunate, or it is un rather unfortunate, that the Biafra hero allowed himself to be captured after a series of secret and open warnings. My consultations, sorry, my consolations, is that the earlier plot to assassinate him was called off after I read public alarm of the bloody consequences, and they insisted, or they instead decided to activate another plan B in accordance with the demands of the 75 northern groups. Now that they have arrested him, I pleaded with the Buhari and the Fulani government to give him a soft landing, reorient, reorientate him, and allow him to go free. I made the same plea when he was earlier arrested and they followed to work for his release. I pleaded with the IPOB youth to exercise residence while we look into the circumstances surrounding his arrest. How to negotiate? and a honorable exit, exit from the zoo. In the one entitled Assassination Plot, Buhari Namdekano Vassinist, vas, uh, vas, Unknown Politicians, by Obin Akuwe, I stated in paragraph 1, 2, 3. Thus, I want to allow the Buhari handlers and the evil elite that part of the event is marked to occur in Nigeria before October 1st of 2021. Leading to the untold chaos is the plan by the deep state and the vaccinist conglomerate to assassinate Muhammad Buhari and another plot by unknown politicians to assassinate Namdekano. Those who took these warnings from impossible diplomatic source that crave anonymity lightly will face the consequences of half mass in Asorok and bloody conflict in the eastern Nigeria. I am writing to alert these individuals because the assassination will likely put Nigeria into another dangerous uh, succession, crisis, and full-blown conflict of unimaginable proportion. I want to warn the international uh, or internal collaborators to put the interests of the nation at heart. What is seen is that uh, he was not allowed the mass vaccinating of Nigerians during the second phase of COVID-19 wave. The deep state has seen Buhari as unwilling tool in the plot to turn Nigeria into a hood uh, vaccine experiment. The pressures to make the COVID-19 vaccine uh, compulsory has failed, and the deep state are shopping for a balanced replacement. It is God that frustrated the attempt to mass vaccinate, vaccinate Nigeria, putting the blame on Buhari shows that the deep state is here to understand 
that there is God that answers prayers in Africa. The Nigeria Friendly Sources are interested in preventing a failed state uh, status for the giant of Africa and have hinted the same information to credible source within the intelligence circles of Nigeria. This is the end of the message, but let us take some reactions so that on Agodo, waiting to go drop at the comment section as well. This one is, after reading this, some people, instead of picking the important things and using them to further their campaign for maximum the kind of freedom, are commenting nonsense. That is Elo Chuku or Hagi. I ain't talk that one. This one is Tibiko Okoye. What is written is written. Biafra, Biafra shall be emancipated and at Mazenam de Kano will be free to just it in due time. Death has no power over him and he who created him and mapped him out for this journey of liberation shall see him victorious. He say, this one is Dark Horse. This Dark Horse is not named. Now, but I know say he's a Nigerian. That would have saved Nigeria. Niger this a waste of taxpayers' money feeding him and wasting cost time. Anyway, uh, case just started. He will spend 25 years no shaking, according to him. This one is Sanola say Chukwu Kabiama is alive and watching over his children. Martin Namdekano and people of goodwill uh, we believe the whole secret gradually coming out openly. Last edited is 10 10 p.m. of 2022 01 of 2024. This one is uh, Daniel Lazarus. The Nigerian state and its 75 northern elders are not in any way close to the power of at African Union and at uh, United Nations or at Governor.uk. So the silence from them that always claim to stand for justice is my problem. Hashtag free Mazen Namdekano now. Hashtag free the Biafran King. Udechi Buzo, he said, Obina Akukwe, the warning I hope you deliver to Mazen Namdekano was for him to stop the Biafra restoration struggle or hide uh, from himself. Possibly, he didn't provide alternatives that can still lead to Biafra exit, which Without, uh, without, it is not relevant. Just warning Mazen Namdekano, the IPOP movement, to do what? This one comes with a question mark. Uh, Obi Nakube, Mwa, answer this one. The last year, but not the least, this one is a Hansi. This doesn't settle well in my mind. It raised many questions. Little Akube of a man sounds like a double agent. It is confusing to decipher where he stands. DOS should dig deeper regarding the activities of this man. Definitely, something needs to be unveiled. Things didn't add up well. Anyway, my wonderful people, I hear me, I go take a break. And I hear my voice again. Like, share, comment, and make sure you subscribe to my channel.